Kieran is mini me, almost, uh, I guess. A lot of people brought up, you know, their books, you know, showing, oh, I've got a bunch of material. I just decided to wing it. Kind of rethinking that whole plan right now, because, uh, yeah. So anyways, Facebook. I hate Facebook more than life. Because if you're not in Facebook, it's like you're going camping for probably about two weeks and you come back and just shit is just crazy. You just, you know, you're just like, well, what's up, man? And he's like, uh, my, my mom fucking died, dude. You didn't know that? And he's like, no, what, did you tell me? No, but I put on my fucking Facebook. You not look at my shit? Uh, I, I, I work, man. You say you don't got like a droid or anything like that? No, I got a fucking flip phone because I'm poor as balls. <laughs> so, sorry, I didn't get it. But the worst thing is, is when you get dumped through Facebook. You're just sitting there, you know, you wake up in the morning, you're like, ah, it's going to be a good day. And you just look on there. Susie has changed her relationship status to single. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> is that my Susie? Yeah, hang on, let me type her name in. Pull up page. There we go. Wall. Marital status single. Say, oh fuck. Okay. <laughs> I didn't drink last night. I'm kind of confused with what's going on. So you call her up. You're like, hey, uh, so uh, what you, what's going on? You know, I'm kind of confused that you're, you know, you're single. But yeah, didn't you read my uh, Facebook status update? They said, come on, okay, I'm no, I don't check all of the shit because it goes down so fast. It's like a damn fucking stupid register thing when you're checking out and got like eight things and it's just like <laughs> and before you know it, you know, oh, by the way, she wants you to send her a thing of lumber for Harvest Town. It's like, bitch, I just got dumped. I don't got time to send you lumber right now. Build your cabin on your own time. I'm going through a crisis right now. Just let it go. Stop. And the worst thing about the Facebook thing is getting in a fight with someone. Because when you go and you confront them, you you automatically are going to get your ass kicked because you just go up there and say, hey man, hey. So, uh, what the fuck did you post on my wall? <laughs> and he's like, what do, you, what do you mean? I didn't post shit on your wall. And you automatically feel like a douche because you're talking about a wall. And then let alone bring in Twitter, that's even better. You're just like, so man, hey, I tweeted, you tweeted that I was a fag at 4.57 p.m. I'm just a little, a little confused. And it just, you're just like, whatever happened to good old fashioned, you know, shit talking, not posting stuff on the walls and stuff like that. It's just, it's ridiculous. But, <sighs> I wish I had a bitch drink right now. God, <laughs> I don't love my bitch drinks. Jesus Lord. In case you guys don't realize, a bitch drink includes pineapple juice and rum. And they're delicious. They don't taste like assholes, which are, you know, what bottled beer is. It's awesome. And I was like, hey, I like beer. Uh, it's cheap, it gets me drunk. Well, that, that's fantastic, friend, but my palate is a little bit more refined. I love the way of Malibu rum and pineapple juice swirls in a glass as the guy hands me the glass looking at me like I'm some sort of douche. He's like, oh, here you go, here's your pineapple and rum, friend. And it's like, oh, thanks, man. I just, uh, it's, uh, it's an off night. I had, I had beer last night. <laughs> No, you didn't. No, you didn't, because you were here last night, you ordered three of them, and then you went home. So, you might as well just forget that shit right now. All right, fine. So, and, uh, there's been a lot of hurricanes going on lately, and I wish one would hit, because I own a house that was built in, like, 1989, and I really need a new roof. And each time, it just shows, it's, like, coming right at me, I'm like, fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, this is awesome. I start collecting like broken shit that I can claim on insurance and stuff. <laughs> yeah. And then in the past three weeks, I've managed to have, you know, three projection TVs in my garage that are just sitting there busted, like the old school shit. And I'm like, oh, you guys can't replace that, so I'll take a plasma. It's not, not a big deal. I mean, I love that TV, but, you know, we're just going to let it go. So. But. God. I really wish I would have planned this shit out. This is ridiculous. These lights are kind of hot. 
but I kind of like it because I can't see any of you guys. So go ahead and tweet away, my friends, tweet away. So, but obviously uh, that's all I got for you guys. So thanks for dealing with shit.